walk, her <laughs> first fashion show. This is where now for a long time I've been telling for my husband. Hi guys and welcome back to another vlog. Um, today's vlog I'm gonna kind of do intro. I want to show you what I got on Amazon. Um, a kind of big haul, but there's not that many things, but a £500 worth of Amazon haul. Uh, but today is Saturday and we are actually heading off to our yearly trip to Pumpkin Patch at Tully's Farm. Uh, so it's going to be Nessa's first day and I absolutely love it there. It's done so well. Um, when we went during Covid, it was quite limited, so it was quite nice that, you know, it wasn't overly busy and today is a beautiful day and I've actually said to my friend Lena uh, to come with us so we're gonna meet them there because they moved house and they no longer are in our neighborhood so no point to drive together we're just gonna meet there and this morning I had a proper pamper session uh, which is much needed and it's really nice at the weekends when Tyke's home and he can take Nessa like Liam is okay like he can just hang around he normally plays or he would have iPad or my phone um, but we think Nessa requires a lot of attention so it was really nice to kind of have a lie in and I tell you what I did um, now my skin texture has never been great um, but at the moment I'm not happy so I'm not happy with my skin texture at all, a lot of like bumps, I would guess that's like clogged pores, like small spots. Um, I have got, I have sorted for now the eczema around the hairline, which is like yay. <laughs> so I've done a peel this morning, Dr. David Jack, the blue one, that's the hydrating one, because obviously the the skin at the same time is quite dry, uh, so I didn't want to have anything uber harsh and <laughs> this camera is just guys yeah I think we get a new camera so second step was um, a Revive clay mask and then I did um, a lot of hydration hydrating B5 from SkinCeuticals it's one of my most favorite brands Skin SkinCeuticals and then my usual La Mer eye cream and then La Mer cream and then I've just done light makeup um, because then I had it out with Liam and I didn't film anything I realized oh no I didn't bring my camera but it was the nicest morning like sun the autumn sun the leaves falling I just love where we live like it's a beautiful houses the big trees it's it's just beautiful so I had to go to send a parcel I sold something I sold on vintage and then uh, pick up formula for Nessa. I got some fresh pastry so I was very naughty this morning. So was Thai. So we had like some pretzels and cinnamon buns. So it was a very very beautiful morning. Um, and I also did my hair. Uh, so I did my hair. It definitely needs a trim but I'm always like in split mind because I want it to grow and at the same time I need to cut it just to keep it healthy. Uh, so I wish I didn't have to but it will have to be done and yeah we're gonna head soon I think in an hour or so I need to think of what to wear because it's always such a cute um, photo opportunity with the pumpkins and with the kids and yeah so I will do the Amazon haul later and tomorrow Nessa's gonna walk <laughs> her first fashion show so we were invited by Bubble Clothing and their partner, I think it's called Raspberry Plum, um, which is a, a luxury kids wear brand. You can get it on like Selfridges, I think I mentioned it in the previous vlog. Um, so I will link it down below so you can guys have a look. Uh, so I will ask Tyke, maybe he's not the best at these things. <laughs> uh, and I will probably ask him on iPhone because with this blurring with a camera, I'm, I'm really worried that we wouldn't get anything. So. Uh, whatever on iPhone, I will ask him to film it. And um, what what else I wanted to say? Oh yeah, we passed the like few of the houses in the area already have got the Halloween decoration, and I just love it. Halloween here is just truly amazing. Uh, so people really put a lot of effort. Um, Halloween here, like trick or treating, is so good. Um, and I just passed a beautiful house. I'm gonna put down like a video because I filmed it for stories. So well decorated, like I loved it. Very subtle, but really nice that, you know, they've done it in advance and not just for Halloween. 
And what else? Oh yeah, I found perfect khaki nail varnish. So I've been obsessed with finding um, khaki one. Uh, my nails are still so bad. So it's all so bumpy from the summer when I went to have it done for my sister's wedding. So I've taught my, I've learned my lessons. <laughs> so I will also link this down below, guys. Uh, you can also get it on Amazon. And yeah, let's start a day. Uh, we're gonna go to pumpkin patch and just enjoy the day. Hi guys, so today is following day, today is Sunday and um, we had a really really nice time at the pumpkin patch. Now I've, tried, I've only filmed a couple of snippets and I filmed it on iPhone just because because we were with friends um, and I wanted to enjoy the time with them. Uh, I'm just, I decided basically just to film bits and pieces and put a bit of music. But it was amazing as always, it's becoming our tradition <laughs> just to go to the Tully's farm, pick pumpkins, have food there, enjoy the festivities and the bus and the vibes. And it's a really lovely place and I've mentioned it last year and the year before, they do have, on in the other part of the farm they have got like a drive-in cinema which I think is so lovely, they would serve like food, um, which is more likely I think organic uh, would basically it comes from the farm which I think is always really authentic and amazing their own produce so that's something I would love to try especially now during this sort of uh, time in autumn I think they do something like I haven't uh, checked it out but um, go guys and have a look it's called Shocktoberfest so I assume it's gonna be like a, a, a festival similar to Oktoberfest um, so yeah, we had a lovely time, and uh, today Nessa's walking the show I've mentioned, well I will be holding her because she can't walk it, um, it's going to be uh, a small thing in uh, Beach Blanket Babylon in the restaurant in Notting Hill, and Tiger and Liam are actually going to stay home. Um, they just decided they're going to stay home and I think maybe it's for the best. Liam wasn't keen to go. I've asked my friend Margita and I'm hoping t until the last minute she will join me, but it was quite short notice, um, so yeah, let's see. I'm gonna try to make the most out of it. Today's meant to be a nice day, rain's meant to come at five o'clock, so hopefully we're covered on that side. We're meant to wear like either all black or all white. So I just went for this simple dress from Theory, which I've had for years. Uh, I've done my heatless curls and yeah, I'm ready to head out. Ness is now having her breakfast, so the guys are downstairs. And in the next part of the vlog, hopefully tomorrow, when Nessa's asleep and I'm waiting for uh, um, the new shower delivery, <laughs> um, I can film the Amazon haul. Uh, so I assume a lot of you guys might be curious uh, what I bought. So I'm going to show you everything tomorrow. We are out, uh, just waiting for our train uh, to go to Blackfriars. And the light is just incredible. I wanted to ask you, because obviously my camera has been really blurry, I'm now filming, let's say at the moment I'm filming on my iPhone. Would you prefer maybe until I get a new camera that I'm uh, maybe vlogging on iPhone, combination, or you maybe not that bothered? Like it does really bother me. <laughs> it's making my life very hard because I'm talking, talking, and then I'm trying, you know, to, to focus. I don't think it's worth it to send the camera for repair. It's not like a, a thousand pound camera. I think it's 400 pound camera, uh, but the one I want is a little bit pricey. So it's not, I'm, I was thinking, do I go again and maybe buy something more affordable or do I save up for the one I really want, uh, which is expensive and then have the one I really want. So let me know maybe in the comments below. Uh, 
I'm just loving this light and uh, yeah I message another friend that lives in Notting Hill uh, if she wants to maybe join us and we could hang around in Notting Hill because I think it's such a waste on a beautiful day like this especially with free brunch after the fashion show in a nice restaurant uh, but she is spending a day in Richmond Park so it's also a beautiful way how to spend time and my best friend Kat is in New Zealand uh, I did ask her right away and because she lives in the area it could be easy for her to kind of pop in but they always go for half term they go and they travel so it doesn't matter. gonna be um, it's been here for so many years one of the most visited restaurants <laughs> item is actually so large that I can't show you just like that here uh, I decided uh, by the way to start a vlog on my phone I just can't handle the camera anymore and I'm gonna basically sell it to one of the reseller sites that also can repair it so I already got a quote this morning so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do it and in the meantime until I get the camera I really want I'm just gonna be basically vlogging on my phone so a little disclaimer so the third uh, first items I'm going to show you um, in the upstairs room um, and as always everything is going to be linked down below so here is my 500 pound Amazon haul so the first item is this would you say chewed or youth rug but I've wanted one of these I just love the texture and how it looks the neutral tones and we basically have got like a spare bedroom more like a guest room slash office but I'm thinking to try this also in the living room. Now this room is not done, so I can't really show you like a nice corner. I'm still working on organizing it, selling a lot of stuff, like there's old cot, but hopefully eventually, once I sell everything and reorganize this room, this is gonna look much nicer, but I think already, the rug really brings the room together. It's actually a decent size. I think it was 230 centimeters, but I will link it down below because I think it was also a very, very good price and amazing quality as well. Now, a second item is a luxury item. What I love about Amazon is, I mean, at the moment you literally can get the anything i i have been a customer of amazon i'm also amazon prime customer so we watch a lot of movies tv series there as well and uh, there's a lot of stuff for kids but i also shop things like beauty vitamins uh, i always shop for my Kerastase shampoos but they also stock luxury pieces premium pieces um, and all you need to do is basically just to google your favorite brand they don't have uh, like everything but they had uh, an item i actually the same item I bought for my friend Kat for her 40th birthday and I had to wait for three months to be basically this to be back in stock pretty much everywhere all over the world until um, until basically the suppliers or the factories started to make more of these and it's the hyped Prada 17WS uh, sunglasses so I got these on Amazon sorry I've already worn them so there's a little stain probably from Nessa and I love these. I um, I gave my friend uh, the white ones, but I picked these tortoise shell, and they were actually really well priced on there as well. 
and these are 100% authentic. I filmed, I think, a few reels already with these, so I'm gonna maybe put it here on the side so you can have a look maybe, guys, within an outfit because I don't have the best lighting. My skin is just in a very, very bad shape at the moment and, yeah, I basically don't look the best, uh, basically how I look at home. Um, but I thought I'm going to crack on with the haul anyway. I've got different options as well, so I will link uh, those below as well. But browse around because they may have, you know, items and type of sunglasses that um, may not be available. And I thought this tortoiseshell print is so beautiful for autumn all year round. But I really can see myself wearing it with all the like neutral trench coats and all black looks and, you know, with my maybe croc bag. So it goes with so many things. And I just love it. It's kind of trendy, but at the same time, I think that sort of brand is going to be here forever. Now, for a long time, I've been telling one of my best friends that I really want to get this device, but the original one, I think it's from a brand called New Face. But when I saw this on Amazon, this is like a budget version or dupe or whatever you want to call it. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to give it a try to see what the results are. The reviews are actually good and the reviews for the new face are amazing and you can definitely see um, across a few weeks if you watch any vlogs, any YouTube videos, women are getting a lot of, um, lot of results. It's basically a facial toning device and this is the first time I am opening this and to me on the picture so far it looks exactly like um, the real thing. This is in pink color. So I need to figure out there's going to be probably a cord to plug it in. Oh, power adapter. You have got a little pouch. I guess this is for cleaning and how to use this. So ultimately, I'm not going to use it now. It's obviously not charged, but you, it's basically for toning your face. You would be going, especially for this area, for the jaw. That's where the women were getting most results. This is, I think, around £40, which I think is a really, really good price. So I'm going to test it out, but I will link it down below, guys, if you're also looking maybe to do a bit of a home spa and really looking after yourself. I don't know how many times a week you can use this, but I will read it maybe in the next vlogs and we can have a look at that. But I think this is really, really good. Also like a really nice present for somebody. So yeah, I'm very excited. Uh, another thing I got is, this is I often also get on Amazon. You just have to be careful, make sure you have got these codes. Sometimes they delete it so people can't check if it's out of date or if it's not the real thing. Um, uh, this is the Olaplex number three. It basically is for strengthening your hair. And I just love this product. I think so many women have tried this. It really does work a magic. I also have got um, kind of like a dupe option, which I ran out. So I thought this time I'm gonna order the Olap, the real thing, Olaplex. And yeah, I'm really trying to basically get my hair healthy and just better looking. I will need a trim though. Uh, you know, this can't work, it's magic, but I think it's amazing when you consistently basically add this to your hair care routine so this is going to be linked down below but uh, guys there's so many other options and so many like great things i normally buy on amazon this is just from this particular haul what i have ordered recently and the last item with halloween coming uh, my son liam wants us to be basically the scooby-doo gang so i'm going to be daphne unfortunately they didn't have my size on amazon so i had to go to another retailer but this one is for my husband he's going to be shaggy liam has got scooby-doo which we already have at home and i got something that <laughs> resembles um velma for nessa but she definitely does not want to have the wig on so yeah we will have to definitely <laughs> work out how um, maybe i will have to write it down on her t-shirt i'm velma i'm part of the gang uh, but this is the one i got they in general like for now guys if you're watching this ahead browse around because they do have a lot of costumes for halloween for kids for adults uh, that are competitively priced and um, so we'll also link this down below they do have actually good velma costume but my son said no i have to be daphne because of my long hair uh, so um, so yeah, that's basically uh, why I'm not Velma and Nessa Daphne, maybe it would be even easier for her to be Daphne uh, because of the light hair and she's got a ginger undertone. But um, yeah, this is the last item I got. So I got ultimately two fashion pieces, if we can call it um, this way. So the luxury item, which is the Prada sunglasses and this one, I got a couple of bits uh, from the beauty section and then one home, I think. So I will call it less is more uh, Amazon that it's not 
tons and tons and so many of um, different items, like smaller items. Uh, but guys, I will also link down my Amazon shop where I basically always link down my favorites, things I like. There's fashion edit, there is a home edit, there's uh, vitamins I regularly buy on Amazon. Uh, so I'll pop the link down below and that's the end of the haul. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching the whole vlog. Um, for the newbies, if you just came here for the haul, I would love it to hit the subscribe button, uh, like the video, and hopefully I will see you in the next vlogs. And yeah, guys, don't forget all the links are below. I'm gonna basically link things I may have mentioned, I wore uh, throughout the whole vlog, and obviously these ones as well. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye -bye.